a government official. Do you remember I... how to read this specific kanji? And you can feel free to read what's in the bold. Um, that is Chu. No, but here, here is Naka. Hi. Naka. And the the kanji following that is a flow, water flowing. Not really. Water flowing is over here, which is um naga, naga deru. This guy's a weird kanji. I think it shows up like a piece of. This is um su nakasu. What I meant to know, dirt in the middle. Hi. Is the, the area of dirt in the middle of the of the river? Hi, perfect little river uh, islands. Perfect. So and it's what, pronounced as Nakachu. Asu Nakasu. 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 Can you read this word for me? Hi. Um. Wang Kyoku. Hi. So Wang Kyoku is Wang basically the same as Magaru. That's the same kanji right here of Magaru, which is bended. So Wang Kyoku is a bend. So let's go Wang read is a bend. this line from the book. Wermeto no machi naka o okiku. ワンチョクいて流れる川にはチュ中州がいくつもあるいくつもなるいくつもあるいくつ is a question word that means how many Mo modifies that the same way we have dare mo, nani mo, and things like that. They basically mean a bunch. So a bunch of nakasus bunch. are aruing. A bunch of nakasu exists right. at the river that flows. The river that flows um, through the bend, through the Wang Kyoku. Kyoku. The particle for what's um, where it's flowing, I suppose, could be uh, Machi no Nakao. Um, the oh. Wang Kyoku shite is a verb. So this is not really going to be modifying that verb. Uh, to some extent, it could reverse modify. So Wang Kyoku could be modifying um, Nagaredu in some way, since te form can have a since type of thing. So at the town in the Nakani, in the middle of the of Puerto Machi, right. there uh, a large Okiku, a large bend. Hi. A large crook of the river. Wankyoku shite nagareru, a large bend that flows through. A river with a large bend that flows through. Hi. The river with a large bend Niwa, that flows through that the look. center of the city. City. At that location, there are Nakasu ga ikutsu mo aru. A bunch of these inlets, these hi, hi. these pile of sand islands. Uh, these these middle terranean. This, mm -hmm. These uh exist. Toyu the mo. Ah no no. Ah uh, yakunin servant. Yakunin. I just assumed that we were that, that you reached yeah. the end of it. 
I'm I'm going too fast for you. Um, do you know how to read this word? Um. Try to come to collect the money. So so. And um, kentori. Starts with ze. So kentori. The kentori. Hi, shakintori is the bad guys. Shakintori, and this is the kintori, which is the tax collectors. Because the kint is um taxes, and tori is the take. Um, so. Let's have you reread. Uh, you don't need to reread it, but read. Tell me what this sentence meant. So it say here, uh, "Wermeto no machi nako o okiku one kyuku chite nagareru kawa ni wa at the river that flows through the bend, the large bend." Um, so the the, the the kawa is basically being described as a nagareru kawa and a wankyoku shite kawa. But wankyoku is not describing nagareru, which is like a little bit complicated of how to translate that into English. I would kind of like almost start with wankyoku. It's a river with a great bend in it. A river with a great bend that flows where? Hey, the river with a great bend that flows through the town of Wermeto. At that location, there are many islands. Perfect. Any idea how to read this word? You? You re you uh Ryoku. 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 So, ri, ro, ro. Ri, ryo, ro. So, it's not ryo, no. it's ryo. So, this is getting that R sound and, and then adding yo, ryo. This is R sound plus o, ro, ryo, ro. Di. So you don't read it as di yo. It's just do. The di here is here because there's no other way to spell our yo. Right? Japanese does not have the consonant r. So they just went. We're gonna take all the e guys. So ki plus yo is not ki yo. It's kyo. Right? So do. So it's not the first. The 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 vowel sound no longer exists for those guys. So, kyo, byo, shō, shō. I think she does get the little bit of the e sound shō, shō sometimes. Um, but it's not supposed to. It's supposed to be. Ryoku. Hi, ryoku. Hi, you ryoku. So this is influential power. Okay. Influential power. Um, osa meru. Which is pronounced, you know, the same as osa meru, which is to give money to somebody. This osa meru with this specific kanji, which as you see has like a water radical and machinery in there for some reason, means to govern. Right. So, water radical is to govern. Sewing is to give money. Very random, but that those are the difference. Osa meru. Um, okay. This word ends with ryoku. What did it start with? It meant influence, influential power. You ryoku. Hi. You. Ryoku. And how about to govern? Osameru. Hi, osameru. Perfect. What is the te form of osameru? The. Uh... Form osame te. Osame te no claro sta. Osame te. Perfect. Osame te. Skip that. Um, can you read this little section for me? Ona koshaku wa. Ona shoshaku wa. Gunga. 
Ar, are, arend, ah, arend, era, arando, aranda, 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 i in no haske, o, borrow, hai, carite, carite, machi o, o same, Kawa no Ika Shi Kawa no Ake Kebo no Gai Ni Aru Akatsuki Go Ten Ni Kunde Iru So you have a relative clause right here describing that. And that, a little random tip right there. But this is all things that the onna koshaku does. What is the first thing that he does? He karirus. First thing is he borrow the help of the yi in, the council member, or the committee, the committee member. Right. Uh, the chosen, the right. chosen committee member. Who do you think chose the these committee Buddha matters? By herself. So, so. She chose them, and then she uses their help in order that she machi o osame rules over the city. Then the second clause. Say, um, sunde iru. The le the um, the second clause say, at the left, at the east bank of the river, there aru there exists, akebono gai, the Don district. Um. So where, why don't you tell me what this means the, all together? Oh, I'm sorry, really. Um, all together is uh, she lives. The Duchess she governs uh, by the help. She governs the city with the help of the council member, which she have chosen herself. Perfect. And she sunde iru, she reside at the um, goten, the sak akasuki referring to the sunrise. Right. The, 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 the rising, the rising mansion, which, which is in the dawn district. Perfect. Perfect. And do you remember how to re say influence in Japanese? Yuryo. Perfect. Yuryoku. Um, tukasadoru also means to govern. I'm not really sure how it's really different than osameru. They both mean um to govern. Yeah, so osameru and tukasadoru both mean um to govern. Uh to have control over. So let's go read the line from the book. Oko o osa meru no wa so it's osa meru govern osa meru osa meru is to govern to manage it is to do. Okay, so koko o Oko osameru no wa machi no mari oku o kasado kasadoru yuri oku na machitsu shi da tachi da the that which is that which govern this this place oko is a um, is the, the group of magicians 
that have influence, have influential governing powers. Um, over have, what? Have, in, have influential over the magic power, the magical power of the of the city. Perfect. Yep. The ones that control this place are the influential magicians who have, who govern the magical power of the city. Perfect. Um, how would you read? How would you read this word? Seryuk. This is the might Seryuk. in power, the mighty power. This word look uses a lot of very similar powers with yuryoku, seryuku, and stuff like that. Um, any idea how to read this word? Seryuku. Uh, oh, sorry. Sandai. Sand right. Sandai. Sandai is used when you want to talk about the three biggest things, like the sand mean from like Naruto. Um, do you know how to read this word? It ended with Ryoku? Say. Say. Right. Say Ryoku. What did that mean? Seiryoku is um, influential power. Hi. Right. Um. Basically, specifically, Seiryoku. it feels more like might as power goes. Like it, like this shows up in Ikioyoku for like vigorously. You could have like vigorous power, perhaps. Um. Versus Yuryoku is definitely is more focusing on the influence. Um. Sore nari means in its own way or with limitations. Sore nari. Um, what what was nari. might in Japanese what again? Say ryoku. Ryoku. Right, say ryoku. Perfect. Um, what do you think barantsu means? Balance the balance. Also oh, perfect. So let's go read the, the line from the book. My jutsu to on a shaku on a show saku to. Hey. Ikure no andai seriyoku wa umaku. Umaku is good. Okay. Umaku is successful or skillful. Yeah, it's it's going well. So, it's going well, things are going well. So umaku modify balance, the the mm. good balance, hotte ite, is to hotte ite. Well, to take. Right, to Toru. take balance. Oh yeah, it's the umaku. You're right. I thought you were using this umaku for some reason. Just register two in the sentence. Yeah, we got good balance as being um taken by who? Who is keeping the balance? So I guess keep is what the taking is meaning in this context. Sandai. Hi. Sandai Seriyoku wa, the okay. influence of the of the great three. Hi. Who are the great three? Is taking the balance. Okay. Sandai are Machutsu Shi. On Ochaku and Ikure no Kimi. Perfect. The yep. magicians, the duchess, and the lord of the twilight. Hi. Um, sore nari ni. This like a weird word. balance, this taking yeah. of the balance, nari ni becomes. For this to be so, for this balance to be so, umak. It need to be 
it needs to continue. It needs to exist in this way in order for these balance to be maintained. That's a good right? guess. I would say your original translation of that was better than your second translation. Um, sore nari means in its this way or with limitations, but it does come from naru to become. So it becomes that is like a literal translation of it. But I'd say like it is kind of like almost like made, I guess. So what is kind of what it's saying here, I guess. So like, like sore dake. Sore dake de umaku iteru. Sore nari ni umake. It, it, this ite iru is iku iru. It is iku, but that's because wanna... umaku gets iku. This is a idiom, umaku iku. Umaku iku means to go well. As you see, weirdly enough, in English, oh, wow. we also add the word go in here. Because iku ah. is to go. To go well. Umaku iku. Umaku ite iru. So, in this, so this little phrase basically means, in this way, things go well. Exactly. So long as these balance are so, in this way, things are well. Perfect. Yes. Yes, exactly like that. And we've reached the end of our time. Um, any questions before we go?